great, but it's hard to believe that it's going to be allowed again. But this is the state of normalcy that I prefer. For the first time in over two years, airline passengers now have the option to fly without a mask. The change comes after a federal judge struck down the nationwide mandate on Monday. Tonight, 25 News reporter Andrew Lamparski is at Waco Regional Airport. Andrew, what are people saying there about seeing all those smiles again? Todd Naya, passengers tell me it's a little strange to see so many faces inside the airport today. While most people I've seen are taking full advantage of the new ruling, others are choosing to still play it safe. For many, uh, yay, no more masks! this moment was long awaited. Walking into the airport mask free. I can breathe <laughs> naturally. Oh, so nice. Way nicer. I hate the stupid muzzle. Waco Regional Airport is one of many in Texas no longer requiring masks. It joins DFW, Love Field, Austin Bergstrom, Colleen, and Houston's George Bush Airport. It is all up to you guys right now. This after a federal ruling on Monday voided the CDC requirement on planes and public transportation. Many airlines were quick to drop their mask rules. We've done it for two years and it's time to uh, to move beyond that and, and now make that the responsibility of individuals. Still, some are staying cautious. It does seem strange yeah. after two, almost three years of always having a mask on. It's just something that just kind of came to me as, came to me as a shock. Angelica Lopez says she'll still be wearing a mask on her flight. I feel like it's very sudden. I don't feel any different than I did yesterday uh, when I intended to wear a mask and had no um, intentions to um, not wear a mask. But in the Waco terminal on Tuesday, those with masks and those without say they're happy to make the decision on their own. We want to have everybody, everyone else feel comfortable around us too. And it looks like they felt comfortable without wearing a mask. As these signs across the country roll away. And tonight we're hearing the DOJ may appeal the judge's ruling if the CDC says masks are still necessary. At Waco Regional Airport, Andrew Lamparski, 25 News.